most of our subjects are pretty wonderful people before they ever meet us, you know? Uh, like it's an honor to interact with them in a little bit of their life journeys. Um, but one uh, finding that's been most striking to me is how highly functioning people become even more highly functioning people in ways that we can measure, you know? Uh, I mean, they're all good folk to begin with. You know, they're not beating their spouses or robbing banks or anything, you know. They're, they're hardworking, caring human beings. But there's a new dimension that often uh, awakens in terms of uh, whether it's caring about the environment or working on relationships with relatives you had decided were hopeless or... Um, volunteering for the Peace Corps or uh, new, new creativity, uh, composing, painting, if, for those who have those skills. Um, but there's, with many of the volunteers, especially those who have experienced transcendental forms of consciousness during the uh, action of psilocybin, th there's this n renewed... Uh, creative urge or involvement and caring for other people in the world. And it's quite inspiring. And, you know, and it, in a way, it's in harmony with what happens in any good psychotherapy. You, you expect some growth, some changes. You know, people who thought they never could be a parent all of a sudden are having their first child and they love it, you know, and so on. <laughs>